What the fuck is up? It's your boy, Little Wayne, Kaki Brick Vision, right back at it again. Um, I told you guys I was going to make a video talking about the Greyhound, um, you know, Greyhound, uh, trip or whatever. I didn't get a chance, um, since I've been back or whatever. So, I guess I can start or whatever. Um, it was uncomfortable. Um, wait, wait, right, right before, right before I even start, um, either criticizing the damn boss thing or or whatever i just want to say this is only my trip or journey or oh, and um and that's it or whatever but um but so i'm not trying to you know change change anybody's fucking um you know thought or whatever to do this damn trip but i'm gonna tell you this right now um it was a lot it was a lot it was a lot um so what happened was i got to um I went to one uh, gray hair. Oh my god, my hair! I need a fucking haircut. Um, damn. So, went to the Greyhound thing, hopped on. Uh, first off, it was a 20-hour fucking bus ride. Okay, 20-hour. Okay, it was f too fucking much. Okay, it stops. The fucking like. Anyway, let me just start from the beginning, man, because I'm going all over the place. Uh, so I get on one bus and. I go from uh, Philly all the way to, um, so from Philly, it was comfortable all the way to Baltimore. Then, it started getting more people up on the bus. So in the beginning of it, when I hopped on the bus, the first, in the beginning, I was like, oh shit, alright, you know, this shit's gonna be good, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking love it and shit like that, you know, it was comfortable feeling or whatever, the seats were soft. Then I get to Baltimore, and... Somebody wants to hop next to me. So I'm like, okay, the seats are already fucking, already like small. They're small already. And, um, so I'm like, okay, I don't want nobody next to me, okay, straight up. You know, it's gonna be a long ass trip. I wanna put my fucking legs up, okay, and I wanna go to sleep, okay? So somebody wants to sit next to me. Fucking handicapped person came on and shit. So the handicapped thing or handicapped wheelchair took up like fucking like eight seats on the damn bus, okay, literally, eight fucking seats or more, so, now, I'm stuck with somebody, so, the guy sitting next to me and shit, you know, whatever, you know, he seemed like a cool guy or whatever, I'm like, okay, uh, now I can't fucking sleep, because I, I don't trust nobody on the fucking bus, you know, with my damn, bu with my bag and shit, anything, so, we go from Baltimore all the way to, so, we go to Baltimore all the way to, like, Washington, Virginia, and stuff like that. So the guy's all clingy with me and shit. I'm like, dude, dude, I came by my fucking self. Why does this guy keep following me and shit? So he's talking to me and stuff like that. You know, I didn't mind it or whatever. You know, whatever. So he's giving me cigarettes and shit. You know, he's offering me, you know, money for food and shit like that. I'm like, okay. You know, I'm not, first off, I'm not taking no offers or whatever with food and money or whatever. I'll take a fucking cigarette. So... <sighs> following me and shit i'm like okay dude like you're getting all clingy and shit like calm the fuck down straight up you know this and that so so i'm trying to make videos and stuff i couldn't even do a lot of videos or any update really that much on every single one it was boring every every single fucking stop was a greyhound stop obviously you know there was nothing really near any any of the greyhound stops you know to take videos of or pictures or whatever it was nothing. It was like a it was like a desert area or whatever. So he's following me and shit or whatever, talking up, you know, talking to storm and shit. I couldn't even get no motherfucking sleep, okay, on that motherfucking bus for the twenty hours I was on it. Okay? I went to sleep for a good two hours of a time. Two hours of a time, you know. Altogether I think I only had motherfucking two, four, six six hours of sleep out of 20 fucking hours that that motherfucking trip man i really i didn't eat i didn't fucking really drink i drunk like at, i think i drunk I, I grabbed like drinks or whatever at uh north carolina or whatever i think north carolina or south carolina one of them damn states so <sighs> grab i grabbed like two sandwiches out of the whole night that's it from uh, two stations or whatever, two Greyhound stations, and then uh, 
Dude, I felt sick. I started feeling sick. I wasn't. I wasn't eating. I wasn't drinking really. I was up all fucking. I was up all fucking night, all the way from midnight all the way to the morning. So like, I couldn't even sleep and shit. I didn't have my seat by myself at all. Um, and and sleep. It was uncomfortable. The seats were uncomfortable as fuck. Um, I was I was like sleeping, sitting up and shit. Like I'm like, what the fuck? Sharing a damp seat again, you know, on the second on the. Uh, was it, what was it? Nah, it was the same bus. I only took two buses all together through the whole trip. Um, at the end of the day, I mean, I, um, the first fucking bus was horrible as fuck. Okay, it was horrible. Dude, I didn't even get no sleep. I didn't get shit. So then the next day or whatever, you know, afternoon, you know, after having, you know, and then, like, I skipped I skipped this part. I uh, went outside. I went outside at midnight or whatever. Cold as fuck. Dude, I was tired as hell. I was going outside with a cigarette and shit. Dude, I almost tripped down the fucking stairs, okay? It, was, it wasn't even fucking... I wasn't even there in the mind, okay? So, I was like, oh shit, dude. I'm like, fucking, whoa. Like, fucking tired of shit. Smoking this fucking cigarette. I think, it like, the cigarette got me really dizzy as fuck, too. You know, being tired slash getting nicotine high. So, I'm like, what the fuck, like... You know, so... So, I'm like... The next day or whatever, it was afternoon. It was like morning, afternoon and shit. I'm waiting for this for my last bus now. The last bus was the fucking was the best one. I wish I was on the second bus the whole damn trip. You know, nobody was on it at all, really. Um, I had my own seat. The seats were bigger. They're fucking softer and shit. Um, and then after that, it was good. Um, you know, so the only problem that I would say was the seats. Um. You know, was that fucking wheelchair or whatever. Uh, so maybe if that wheelchair wasn't around and I had my own seat, I probably would have had a better ass experience and shit. Wi-Fi didn't even fucking work. Okay, it was it was trash. I couldn't even use my Wi-Fi, so I was using all my gigabytes on my damn service. Um, so, and then the stops barely had food and shit. And we stopped at Washington or whatever. Fucking got girl or whatever was rushing us. I'm like, what the fuck? Like... The fuck, you couldn't even get on to fucking eat. So I'm like, damn, dog. Like, so that, so I would say next time I'm taking a fucking plane, I'm gonna lift my balls up and I'm gonna take a fucking plane. Um, I mean, I don't know. It depends. I mean, but I probably would have a different effect after. I mean, when I get there from here on the plane, maybe. Cause when I got when I got off that bus, man, I was fucking tired as fuck. Okay, when I got that that same night, I got I was dizzy. I was dizzy as fuck. Like, I, I think I was, like, jet lag or, or or whatever. Like, I was, yo, I was out of it. Like, I was really, like, the, the, the fucking room was spinning. I was, I was like, really sick. I was, like, whoa. Like, I was seeing shit spinning and shit. I couldn't even focus. Like, I was out of it, really out of it. I think I was really, really, really tired as hell. Um, so, so thank God that, you know, um, you know, I got off that bus or whatever, and then when that same night, I went right to sleep. I went right to fucking sleep. All the tiredness and all the exhaustion fell on me, and um, I was like, "Damn, man!" I was like, "I'm gonna go to sleep. I can't play a fucking game. It was that bad." So I was like, I went to sleep. You know, at my uncle's house or whatever. Um, and then the next morning, um, right after that 20-hour fucking sleep. I mean, that, that sleep, 20 hours sleep, holy shit, that would have been a lot. I had a 12 hour sleep, matter of fact. So, I got up from a 12 hour sleep, and I get up and shit in the morning, and we, U Haul's getting packed and shit. I'm like, what the fuck? So, I didn't even spend anything, or, or didn't even spend time down there. I was automatic, moving, moving, moving. It was moving. All the, all the fucking whole days, every day, every day since I got there, every day. We, we, I mean, it only took that one day since I got up. I got up, we packed up the fucking U-Haul, and then that same night, that same night right there, we left. We started driving all the fucking South Carolina, and that was it. That's the only experience I had. I mean, I had one experience of getting up in the morning in Florida and going outside. It was like fucking, felt like a 90 or 100 fucking degrees. It was, I was sweating. Once I opened that door... It was humid as fuck. It was humid as fuck. It wasn't good. Dude, it was hot as hell. Um, dude, I was sweating bullets in my line. 
So yeah, that was that was a trip, man. That was a that was the trip. It was overwhelming. Uh, so I learned I learned what to do this time and what to bring this time. Um, I mean, I brought what I needed or whatever. So it wasn't that like I it wasn't like I fucking forgot shit or like I needed to bring extra shit or shit like that. I couldn't even sleep. It was like that, you know. If I had sleep, maybe, you know, instead of staying the fuck up all them hours at midnight, it would probably would have made me feel a little more better. But since, like I said, after I got there that night, went to sleep, got up, so I did. I felt dizzy them every single day, every single day since I was down there, every single day, spinning, fucking sick feeling, dude. I, I, it wasn't a good experience, man. I, I don't know. Maybe it would have been better probably if I had somebody with me, but that Greyhound experience was not really fucking good at all. So, like I said, next time I get down there, with, well, next time I do go down there, which is probably going to be a couple months or something like that, I don't know. My uncle's supposed to take me down there or whatever again. This time I'm going on a plane. So, definitely going to have some videos and pictures out of the plane view. Um, I probably won't do a lot because I probably would um. I'm probably going to have anxiety, and I'm probably going to have headphones in the whole fucking time, and be on my phone, so, but it's better than 20 hours, I'm, I'll be there in two hours, so, I'd rather that than fucking be there and be stressed out and not really get any sleep at all, I can just be two hours and there, so, it's going to be a better experience, I guess, I'm with somebody now, with two, with people I know or whatever with me, and, so, yeah, that's it, man, that's, as my experience with the Greyhound, um, like I said, it really the only thing I can really say about about them was the Wi-Fi and you know just the that's it the Wi-Fi and the stops and shit. I mean they have to stop period, you know, no matter what for the people and shit. But it was just it was just too quick. People were just fucking. It was it was just too quick, man. It was too much. And, um, damn, my back hurt. But I got my sleep in and shit. I got my sleep in. I got my, I'm back, I'm back to normal now. So I'm, I'm going to get back to doing my YouTube shit again. I haven't been on here for a little bit. You know, I haven't talked about the Eagles or whatever for a long time. Or not a long time, but like a couple weeks or whatever. So, so yeah. So, um, then that's it, man. More videos are going to come. Um, like I said, I'm probably going to make a schedule when I'm going to do these videos and stuff like that. Please subscribe if you're not subscribed. I am not boring. I swear I talk about my vision. Um, and if you guys did get to this far in the video, I appreciate it. I love y'all. Um, like this video, subscribe, like I said, and more are going to come. Uh, you can also go on my other channel, Cocky Prick Vision, um, and subscribe to that one. And, um... Yeah, thank you guys for watching the video and uh, have a good one.